welcome back to my channel. It's Rochelle. You guys are so cute. <laughs> anyway, so obviously the title of this video is my black and white room makeover. Uh, I did my room over in a black and white theme and I just filmed it for you guys. I wasn't making a video for like this purpose for making a video. I was just redoing my room and just filming it as I went along. So some parts are going to be like missing but if you guys want to see in more detail how I did certain things or where I got certain things, obviously comment down below. But um, I'm not going to do too much talking. I'm just going to let you guys watch the video. So enjoy! So the first thing I'm going to be doing is cleaning out my drawers. Since I want to redo my room and kind of make it look cute, I might as well clean my drawers as well. I have so many clothes that I do not wear jumbled up with the clothes that I do wear and it makes it so hard to find the clothes that I want to wear. <laughs> So I'm going to go ahead, put these in a bag, and send them off to Salvation Army. And going forward, I always have a little bag. So instead of putting it in my drawer, I put it in my donation bag. And that takes care of that. Now the first thing I'm going to be doing is making my fake window. So I have a picture frame that I got from Salvation Army and I kicked the picture out, which hindsight, I wish I didn't take the picture out because what I ended up doing was putting some cardboard in there and lining it with foil paper, but I should have just left the actual picture. Also, I have this LED light that I got from Amazon. Um, you don't have to get it from Amazon. You can go to Walmart or go to Winners and they have tons of selection. Anyway, so this is what it looks like posted on my wall um, this light LED light has different color options and it can go darker or brighter but I'm going to leave it on the regular daylight type of look because that is what I'm going for now I forgot to film how I made my curtains but I actually just got some fabric from fabric land and made these curtains it took like literally 10 seconds so if you guys want some curtains I really suggest you go to fabric land and, and try to make them yourself it's pretty easy now Naomi's helping me move my bed from its current position to in front of my window lol also you guys I made my own headboard and I have a video on how I did that so if you guys are interested I'll leave the link in the description box below So this is a cabinet that I have and I use it to store my jeans and my pants and I felt like a, it doesn't match the room because of the color and it's really big and bulky and so I went on Pinterest and I was kind of googling like what are people doing to save space and I found this really neat idea. It's a wire basket um, drawer that I got from Ikea. It only comes in white so I actually had to spray paint it black and guys I made a huge mistake because I spray painted in the basement because I figured there was enough you know room but I did not read the instructions carefully enough because it's poison! Ah! And the reason I didn't go outside with it was because it was like negative degree weather so I didn't want to spray paint outside in the ice cold so I got really sick and I ended up getting strep throat. So guys, make sure you read the instructions and be safe. But anyways, this is what the drawer looks like, all painted. I've rolled my pants up to save space and I love it so much better. Now I bought these lamps from Walmart. It's a white base and I have a black lamp shade. So this is what that looks like. I have two side tables, so one for each. Now I'm gonna be just putting up my mirror onto my dresser. So I've had it behind my dresser for a long time and I was like, hmm, I think this is a good time to put it up. I got these um, mirror trays from Winners as well or HomeSense. Our Winners and HomeSense is like in the same store and they were on sale so um yeah yeah savings i put those on the sides and then i got this other really cute tray now this one was um actually broken or or defective because it's missing a leg but i was like oh two legs is good enough and it actually is really cute because it's kind of like tilted so i'm just putting that in the center of my dresser see what i mean guys cute right now this light is hideous 
and it's got to go so i'm going to change it for this light that i got from home depot it has like five little bulb things i ordered the bulbs from amazon and now just for some decor i have this painting also on sale as i love i love when i get my ish on sale got this cute little i don't even know what this is but it's black and i like it i got a black vase every time you see that red tag you know i'm chiching a saving now this oh this is my favorite thing i got this from rose forever new york so essentially they are a box of roses gifting company and they come in this beautiful box as you guys can see looks like velvet or velour it just looks really luxurious they make perfect gifts or you can get them to decorate your space like i'm using them for today so um i do have a coupon code for you guys who are interested i'll leave it in the description box below so be sure to check it out i believe it's 20 dollars off your first order so that'll be down below and be sure to check them out they have tons of colors variety shapes and sizes so yeah these will be perfect right on my side table but guys this is pretty much my little room makeover so i hope you guys enjoyed this video and be sure to check out rose forever new york i'm going to leave their link in the description box below so yeah i hope you guys are inspired to maybe try something new in your bedrooms and if you guys have any questions about anything i did let me know comment down below and be sure to give this video a thumbs up and i'll see you guys next time love you bye